Hello everyone, welcome to Dulcie's Creations. Thank you to all the new, to you all the subscribers and welcome to all those of you that are new. Please remember to like, subscribe and press that bell so that you, that you are notified of the new upcoming projects. Clearly I'm having a hard time talking today. So let's get into our next project. Okay, so what we're going to do today, I have prepped this board. It's an MDF board. It's about three millimeters thick. Um, it has got masking tape on the back to protect it. There's five cups in there. Um, so that is level. And what I'm going to do, this is going to be a resin pour. Now, sorry if I sound funny. I'm speaking half through my marks and half on the outside. So I've found that the last few times I've used resin, I've been getting terrible, terrible headaches, so I thought I'd better wear my mask. Um, so I've mixed all my resin. There's white in here. Um, this is emerald or a little bit of sheen in there, a lot of bubbles. Some black. Um, gold. And then this beautiful, um, I think it's called iridescent green yellow. So I'm going to do a pour with these. It is a project for my daughter, so I'm hoping it does turn out well. Unfortunately, there won't be any speaking during it, so I will try and do a voiceover to the best of my ability. But yeah, I'm just going to pour and see how it goes. Alrighty then. So what I start off with is the white. I'm going to pour some white in the corner there and then spread it out. And then I follow that on with all the other colors. Now, you've got to remember, I don't really have a clear idea of what I will be doing, how I'm going to be putting it. So it's, it's a gamble. My daughter did send me a picture of something she would like, but as most of us that work with resin or work with acrylic pores, we know we can never recreate our own work, never mind about someone else, because resin has a mind of its own, acrylic paint has a mind of its own, and the minute you pour it, I actually think resin is a lot easier to uh, manipulate into certain places, but acrylic paint, not as much. Anyway, so please do enjoy it, and I will pop in every once in a while, once, you know, it, I do start making cha making. Uh, you know putting other things in and moving the paints around and that but for now as you will see it's just pouring the different colors I will use my torch to blow out bubbles
Okay, so I had finished all the resin and it had started to get a little bit thick by the time I'd start pouring it all. Now here I take out my heat gun and um, start spreading it a bit, especially where it was um, a little bit thicker and it didn't quite um, fill in quite nicely in, in the last corner that I was doing it. So I took the heat gun and I started spreading the resin as much as I could or where I wanted it to go type thing. And then you will see me put in a little bit of black here and a little bit of gold there and some more black here and some more black there. You'll also see me heating up where the cup where the black is because of course the resin has, got it, has gotten harder. Um, that did help it become more liquid and I was able to pour a bit more. Um, towards the end, you will see me put some um, crystals. It's what they usually use on tables for decorations at parties. So I put a few of those down. Um, and I also did put a little bit of glitter, but I, I, for some reason I don't know if, I, if the recording had stopped or what had happened. But it's not there. You will see it obviously in the, in the photos at the end. So please do stay to the very end for some photos and a close-up and thank you so very much for being here with me during this project of mine and I hope to see you all soon. Please do remember to like, subscribe, press that button to be notified of all the upcoming projects but remember please stay safe, stay well wherever in the world you are. I will speak to you all very soon. Thank you for now. Well, here you go, Bye -bye. everyone. Here's a dry, my dried resin. I think it looks absolutely gorgeous. Now, there will be another one. My daughter's asked me to do another one with different colors. So I'll be doing that one soon. But in the meantime, you will enjoy this one. And thank you all so much for being here. Bye for now.